Do you have self-respect? I'm going to go out on a limb and say a fair chunk of you do not. Ask yourself, was that something that was taught in school? I'm guessing probably not. Because if you were taught self-respect, you wouldn't fall for their conditioning. Instead, you were taught self-doubt, questioning why you did things. You did things because you were taught to parrot what was being told to you. Memorization was rewarded. Free thought was punished. The education system wants to get the kids younger and younger. Not so they can teach them anything. So they can soften their mind. To soften their mind while it's still being developed. So they will not question what is being taught to them. How does that improve the child's future? It doesn't. It leaves them at the mercy of who's ever willing to be their educator. If you have a strong mind, their ideas that they're trying to push will not be accepted. A child would see the manipulation and reject it. So they have to do their best to weaken the mind. It only takes a generation to subvert the population. And that is what is going on now. Take away the thinking skills of the youth and let them swim in self-doubt. When they get to that point and they feel that they are drowning, that's when the education system steps in. They show them a path so they can feel accepted by their peers. I saw this years ago. I spent nine years in education. I didn't have my youngest do high school. He got his GED instead. He was testing out of high school in reading and math in seventh grade. He's now a precision aerospace machinist. The education and medical system tried to say he was ADD. We didn't accept that diagnosis. We learned organizational skills instead. The education system will do its best to squash the child's self-awareness, self-esteem, and critical thinking. Because it's their job to make good little cash cows. Tax slaves who will work on the illusion that they will retire. A large portion will not retire. So everything that is put into the system will end up in the hands of the lawmakers. I'm sure this is an unpopular opinion. I'm old. I don't care. It needs to be said. All my love, Miss Dragon.